After you have a fully fleshed out schematic of the page layout needed in InDesign to create your brochure, it is time to move pages in your digital document to match the layout. This requires page shuffling to be turned off. Once page shuffling has been turned off, you may drag and drop each page into the correct position as determined by your needed page sequencing. All pages that connect via a fold should physically touch. If you drop a page into position and a space appears between the pages, you must do it again. A rectangular bracket will appear in a C shape as you are dragging and dropping. This icon is indicating that your drop will attach to the page it is nearest to. Note, page numbers will automatically update whether page shuffling is turned on or off. You do not need to worry about manually adjusting your page numbers. And when we talk about pages shuffling, we're talking about the content on the pages shuffling up. Page 2, or the position of page 2, is always going to be page 2. If you insert a page in front of it, that becomes a new page 2, and then your old page 2 will flow backwards or shuffle downward to become page 3. I have some tips for moving pages. First, start at the end of your layout and work your way forward. Your dummy and schematic have the core pages labeled. If you work from the back of the book and move forward, or chronologically to the beginning of the book, the page numbers you are working with will always match the schematic. If you start with page 1 every time you add a page, all of the page numbers will shuffle and it will change so it will not match your schematic. Double check your schematic before starting. Make sure it matches your physical dummy precisely.